he's shimmering, bro. His f***ing mustache just glistened at me. Wow, that's special. F***ing hyphy, dude. Like, I should just do that before every video. Would you guys think I'm sicker if I did that? What's up guys, Derek, moreplaysmoredates.com. Today we are going to be talking about the rabbit hole that I regretfully have stumbled down, but couldn't help myself <laughs> once I got there, bro. Like my TikTok is not back still, but I do have this now, which is my at more plates TikTok. So if you haven't followed it, go check it out. Um, if you haven't reported a problem to TikTok, by the way, and asked for them to reinstate my original account at more plates, more dates, if you can do that, it'd be very much appreciated because I would love to get that account back. So I'm not posting on this one, but for now I'm at more plates. Now this guy, Zeus official, he is, uh, and it was recommended to me or is in my for you page or whatever because apparently i just like really like shit that the algorithm thinks is relevant to this guy or it's just what by default i get fed because i'm brand new to the platform i guess like i don't fucking know but anyways this guy is a mythical creature or mythical figure sorry speaks uh, very highly of, highly of himself evidently um and he's the official zeus with an e not an a and an underscore bro so he is, uh, you know, portraying a, like, literally Zeus, you know, he's fucking mythical, he's almighty and shit. And here he is, you know, taking pictures with people, being a kind Samaritan. Almighty fucking hyphy, bro. So this kid, he wants a pic, and the mom's like, oh my god, thank you so much. He's like, oh god, so many pics, it's exhausting. This chick wants a pic too. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, oh, can we come in here? I My little one needs a picture of fucking Zeus the Almighty. Here we go, bro. Um, he's like, yep, yep. All in a day's work. Such a handsome man. Zeus rules. Amazing. The king. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know what this is, bro. Pant blowing a cloud. Exhale gasping for air. Mr. Nice Guy. Top. I'm in love with him. Or I'm love with him. It's Lamborghini CEO. <laughs> French lawyer even says so on his LinkedIn page. Not again. It's not Stefan Winkleman. How many times do people see things on here, believe it, and pass it on as truth? Quite scary. Who is this guy? Really? Influencer? Models? Is he perhaps just of a marketing campaign with Lamborghini? In one interview, he said he's an actor. Zeus, where did you purchase your great shirt? Is that a great shirt? It looks like a pretty fucking deep, <laughs> deep neck hole, if you ask me. Like this... I don't know, man. This seems like the antithesis of a nice shirt. Like, I don't know. Maybe if I was on vacation and I just wanted like a bum around like comfy shirt. I don't know. Like this seems, uh, that's like the deepest, like your nips are fucking literally popping out of the shirt. Essentially. Here he is with some, uh, some broads just chilling. So take me baby. So Fucking sick, bro. Quite the compilation. This guy's going, going on this page. So he's got the same, presumably the same shirt in black. So deep, his chain is almost inside the shirt, and he has these chicks with their pea coats and whatever, all fucking dolled up, and he is off to an important meeting, evidently. Again, this guy, all he does is walk slow motion on the street. So this is the thing. I was like, is this guy a guru trying to sell a course, or like, what the fuck is his deal? Because all he does is really post how sick he is with his uh, Lambo and walking with chicks, evidently. And he like literally, in like the most douchebaggy way possible, like edits the fuck out of them to add like slow motion and stuff as if it's a movie. Yes, but he looks epic. What do you expect from a CEO of Lambo? He is not CEO of Lamborghini. Stefan Winkleman is you fuck. Um, these two look expensive. Panting, laughing. Money and ladies, taxi driver. <laughs> Imagine CEO of Lamborghini. He is not CEO of Lambo. Stefan is Lambo CEO, you fuck. Um, La Ferrari Rouge something something in something I can't even read. Is that French? La Boss. What this man works. Did he build a business or invest in Um, he runs the Lambo Corporation. <laughs> so this guy has, uh, well, I don't know if it's his, but he has an Aventador. Um, and it looks like, I don't know if it's an Aventador S or if it's, uh, the LP 700 or what it is, but it's, uh, you know, it's a fucking sick car nonetheless. 
And it seems like all he really does is post up in the middle of fucking, you know, sidewalk seemingly, or just the middle of like the walkways of stuff, gets out, starts walking somewhere in slow motion like he's super important and gets people to like, look, here's his initial foray into TikTok. He posts a nice shot of him uh, looking at the camera and he's shimmering, bro. His fucking mustache just glistened at me. Wow, that's special. Fucking hyphy, dude. Like, I should just do that before every video. Would you guys think I'm sicker if I did that? All right, so here we go. A Lamborghini Aventador, 420,000 euro, presumably. Acteur, qu'est-ce que vous conseillez aux jeunes pour réussir dans la vie et se faire une belle Lamborghini? Avoir de la chance. Somebody's gonna have to tell me what that was in English, because I have no idea. Bonjour, monsieur. Hello, mister. What do you do for a living? Is that what he's saying? I'm an actor. I'm fucking Zeus, bitch. Drives away. I'm a fucking sick actor, bro. I'm playing Zeus. Peace. Give me some money, bro. Top comment. <laughs> Uninstall TikTok and get a job, you fucking bum. Actor, say key, say Mac. Ill fate de films X, what films have you been in? Of films, diff is, diff is something. I'm not even gonna try. Dream car, fucking fireworks. Um, so his whole page is basically this, like him, uh, here he is posing with broads. Uh, I'm taking a sick selfie, another selfie. Oh. What is this? Son Holmes. He is the uh, marketing, uh, I don't know, the face behind AYV.France fucking skincare. I don't know. But um, a lot of his compilations are basically him walking to do something super fancy, like going to your event the door to just like, you know, I'm just a casual day, bro. I'm going barefoot to play fucking tennis. Like, what do you think? See you later, bitch. I'm going to act or play tennis. Here I am in front of my uh, mural. Just, uh, you know, doing important phone calls. It's just a picture, playing as a video. He is out on the town, bro, or it's cut off. I have no idea. Visiting Earth. <laughs> oh, it's the same shot, bro. Uh, let's see. Him with his, uh, apparently his bodyguard, believe it or not, because you can't walk with a, uh, I don't know, portfolio of fucking cash without a bodyguard, or you just can't walk without a bodyguard because you're too you're too famous, bro. I thought you're Zeus. Isn't that almighty Zeus able to defend himself? This is, I think, my favorite one. He gets out of the uh, his driver's car. So he has a driver who's also his bodyguard, opens the door, lets him out, only for him to walk over in front of people who are watching, get in the event the door, and then leave. <laughs> I want to see this guy. Shake hand, punch you in the fucking face. When can I get this guy to say, hi, I mean, he's Zeus. Zeus and Blade. <laughs> so his Instagram too, it's basically just the same shit um, of him, you know, showing how fucking sick his life is. You know, here he is walking um, somewhere in Europe, sitting on the hood of the Aventador with some broad, some dime piece, bro. And just showing her how the car works because she's so interested in the machinery, of course. She literally, she 100% cares, you know, how the steering, steering wheel is formatted of the Aventador. Giving, you know, life advice. You know, this is how you fuck shit up. Ha ha ha. So good. So good. This is what it's like to be Zeus. Ha ha ha. So good. Who is this clown? K. Chingon something. I don't fucking know. Here's another shot. 118,000 views of him literally just standing here with potato quality fucking footage staring at you like what is this what the fuck is this page i generally am intrigued what the utility of it is is he trying to just get famous just for the sake of like inflating his ego i don't really understand here he is with his dog looking at the inside of his car look at that fucking magnificent piece of machinery my dog look at it this is what we do for fun we park the car and then we walk away doing an important phone call like, can you imagine some guy who's just like, he just happens to be filming while you're walking and then you, you, got a, you got a phone call coming in. Like, this is, the fucked up thing is how this is like staged. Like, it's so weird. He looks lost, crying, laughing face, almost falling over because my sides hurt. Or Alzheimer. Clearly can't get the phone figured out. Um, where do we find the clothes he's wearing? 
his closet. Who cares? Givenchy, Givenchy, Goodwill. Givenchy Pie, by the way, a good fucking fragrance that I think has been neutered in performance, but it was good back in the day. Good winter fragrance. Um, the funniest thing is he posts stories as if it's like live footage, but it's just him again with his fucking bodyguard, bro. Getting out, walking across. And this is new edits, bro. Like he has, you know, a new song playing over it, even though it's the same clip he's posted like on multiple different things. Here I am doing an important phone call. Get the fuck out the way, you know? Does this guy just own one jumper and one pair of boots? Crying laughing face. Giving Tindler vibes. You're very rich, but only the same t-shirt, bro. <laughs> um, he's not rich, just promo. And the same pants. He spent all the money on the car. Falling over laughing three times. Brutal. Now, on YouTube, he is a true success story, if you didn't know. Here is the inside of my trunk and my car. Need you guys to park it for me, because I have very important meetings to attend to. Remember him? He's now living his best life. Yeah, living the best life in Paris, bro. I just show up, open the fucking door of my car, walk around, and, uh, you know, impress the shit out of people. Zeus has hashtag Lamborghini, hashtag Monaco. Zeus, living the ultimate luxury lifestyle. Heart eyes emoji. Zeus walking in Paris, a true success story. Zeus official is back. He really is really super stunning and incredible charisma. <laughs> you can't make it up, bro. Luxury lifestyle. You know, just walking with my coat, getting in my Aventador. All you peasants can record me as I drive away as I go on to my next acting job. So I thought for sure this guy was just going to be inflating the fuck out of his social media presence. So I went to Social Blade to see. And typically, if you see guys like buying their following and shit like that, you will look under their statistics and see drops in follower counts. Because again, if this guy was so popular, if people were really like, you know, getting inspired by him or whatever it is that he's trying to do, like no one would be unfollowing necessarily, especially because he's new and hyped up. And somehow here he ends up, he has a couple days where people fall off and then everything starts to pick up aggressively again. And he's been gaining like uh, like no other bro. Like he gains faster on Instagram than most people I know. Like most top creators I know don't gain this fast. And it's uh, you know impressive if it was actually real. <laughs> I'm just skeptical, dude. Like this, I don't know if he fell off. And uh, like basically, I'm assuming this guy is like, if he's willing to spend the money to you know film these scenes spend the money on the car that he's going to use for promotional footage like why would he i don't know would it be unorthodox to think that he'd be willing to spend money to build his following too like it just seems like the guy's coming out of nowhere and i was just looking for the course i'm like where is the course that he's using to cash in off of or if, is he just a guy who has money to throw around and he's like what better way to do it than to build this like douchebaggy persona and you know come across as really important and i speculate for now it's probably the ego thing here he is master at work Thank you for filming me, all he's thinking, you know, because this was a totally unplanned thing. Just the paparazzi again are just out and about while I'm trying to take a swim with my bodyguard. Can these people ever leave me alone? Evidently not, though. No bio yet, incoming. Who knows? Is this guy going to be the next, you know, entrepreneurial self-help guru? Is he, who knows? I don't know. I'm just interested when guys are going to this extent to make themselves like, seems so important like he's so mysterious like we don't even know his fucking name he's just zeus he's mythical he is you know showing his incredible charisma and he's super stunning you know just parking his lambo and just getting in it and making everyone super jealous like i, I don't get it bro like, what is the point of this shit and why does tiktok think it's i don't know like i guess it's viral type content like you see hot chicks you see fast cars you see this you know mysterious human being all he does for a living is just get out of, uh, you know, an Aventador and walk around and, you know, mean mug the camera. I don't think he smiled, bro, in one post. I don't think he knows how to smile, to be honest. But he's keeping up the persona. He's doing a good job at it. So anyways, this is the rabbit holes that I need to not go down when I'm on TikTok. I'm trying to fucking work. I'm trying to do a post. And then the For You page just blasts me with goddamn Zeus official. Crazy, you know? Is this guy actually famous? I, I doubt it, but I mean, maybe he will be. Who knows? Maybe this shit's working for him. Um, so anyways, check me out on TikTok. This is my TikTok promotional video, bro. Yeah, and um, like for me, I always get you know skeptical when I see guys who are going out of their way to flex their shit. 
um, versus just you know organically let like their businesses and whatnot do the talking for them, so to speak. So I have no idea what this guy does. I have no idea if he's legit. I would assume this is you know a guy who has some money to throw around and wants to uh, you know like what is the first thing guys do when they get rich but they don't have the clout that may be desirable, you know, start a YouTube channel oftentimes. Like, it's kind of crazy when you have guys who are like hyper successful entrepreneurs and then are like, you know what, I'm not fulfilled by this amount of money. Let's go build a YouTube channel now and get famous too. And maybe that's uh, the next move for him. So anyways, if you guys know who this guy actually is and what his story is, that'd be interesting because it'd be kind of wild if he was, act like what I suspect, it's just wild if that's actually the case and he just wants to be like some famous for walking to his fucking car and getting out and like walking around with a couple of chicks on his arm. Um, or is he actually the face of some like massive like skincare line? I don't know. All the comments help the algorithm. They're much appreciated. Like, subscribe, check out my blog, moreplacemoredates.com. Follow my Instagram, moreplacemoredates, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, TikTok. Follow me there, bro. Sickest platform. Fucking love it. Um, and anything else I'm associated with, if you want to support me, it's all in the video description below. Talk to you guys soon.